I went to school just to please my dad Developed some anger as aftermath I fell off the course while you wait for a Porsche I'm coming in late off a helipad I ain't got that money, my nose always running Hey, what's going on guys? So, Aeonium Sky delayed And now it's going to be launching again today Probably about 5 hours from the time this video comes out And somebody also uh, commented that they wanted me to talk about how to go uh, NAMI through a Daedalus node so there's already a video on this on YouTube, which I will link in the description if you want to go show support for the original person who created this video and showed how to do it. But I'll also be showing a very quick rundown on how to do it on my channel. All right, so first you're going to go to github.com slash input dash output dash HK slash Cardano dash node. I'll link it in the description. You're going to scroll down and you're going to click the download here for Windows executable. It'll bring you to this page. You'll click here. A zip file will pop up it takes a minute I don't know why but I'll cut to it popping up all right here it is and just extract this and put it somewhere on your computer you can name it whatever you want but this is the Cardano node folder I extracted mine put it on my D Drive and I called it Cardano node and you can see that it looks like this when you open it up so once you've done that you're going to open up a PowerShell I tried to use a command prompt but the uh, environment um, variables did not work with this because you have to use a command that actually sets the variable so I'll show you how to do that mine's in my D drive so D colon n and then change directory to Cardon and then hit tab it'll fill it out for you Cardano node that's what I've called mine next you're gonna go in and you're going to type in this command dollar sign environment you know whatever I'll link it in the uh, in the description and this is going to set this Cardano node socket path to uh, where it actually links. And that's important for the next command that we're going to run right here, Cardano submit API, and then it calls this variable so that you don't need to yourself. And then you'll click that and it should run it. Uh, the reason why mine's not running it is because my data list is not open. So I'll actually open my data list right now. It'll take forever. You're not going to see it, but if your data list is open, it's going to work. And we're also setting it to the port of 8090. And if for whatever reason it's not working, maybe your 8090 port is taken. So just try to change that to maybe 8091 or something along those lines. All right, I got to move my face for this one. So the last part is you go over to your NAMI wallet. And then, whoops, I'm already there. And then you click on your face. And then you click on settings, you click on network. You click on custom node. Make sure this is on mainnet. If you've never touched it, it should be. And then you're going to type in this command here. It's not a command. It's just telling you where it's going to be submitting the transaction through. And I'll have this in the description as well, but it's just HTTP localhost 8090 because that's the port API submit TX for transaction. And that'll make it run through your data list. Keep in mind, your data list does need to be opened. Your data list does need to be up to date. And uh, if you shut off your computer, you will have to open up PowerShell again. You will need to go to your Cardano node folder. You will need to type in these commands again. But if your PowerShell is anything like mine, you can just press the up button and it will scroll through all of your commands even after the computer has shut off. So you don't need to remember these. You just need to keep them in your like local memory. All right, so I'm wrapping up this video, but I wanted to shout out Pernus Token. He's the one who created this method and showed everybody originally how to connect your NAMI to a Daedalus node. So shout outs to Pernus Token. Uh, if you have any questions, definitely go over to his channel and post those questions in his channel because I'm not the smart one. All I did was copy a method from him and put it on my channel. My channel has a few more viewers, so I did want to get this method out to more people. But as you can see, he's doing very well. 7,000 views on this uh, how-to video, so that's really cool. Um, but this will definitely help your NAMI run much more smoothly and it won't be using Brock for block frosts api to run it so your transaction should go much smoother if any of this content helped you remember to like and subscribe remember to get outside see a family see your friends we're here to make more money so we can spend more time with them until next time guys peace i get it like a g but it never came easy you got me coughing up a lung i wish a rap like wheezy i keep my pace so i'm sorry that i'm breezy keep my sneaks laced because i can't afford yeezys i don't want the gold give me btc y'all be acting crazy